Brothers, it is time. It is time for the thing you have all been waiting for. Now you guys have been watching me go through this Warhammer journey for like the past month. When I watched my first video, Astartes, and yeah, I knew nothing about Warhammer back then. We, we come to now and I know a lot. We've watched over 50 videos, which you can see in the playlist, man. We've conquered Orcs, Tyranids, Eldar, the Tau, the Imperium. We've learned about pretty much every kind of significant thing. There's still a lot we have to cover. But I feel that it's appropriate time right now, brothers, to start if the Emperor had a text-to-speech device, which we will be starting right now because a lot of you say it's time. And I agree, it's time to start this series. So without further ado, we're going to get in to this video. I'm excited, man. I'm sure you guys are excited. We're only going to do episode one, though, in this, ep in this one, okay? We're only going to start with episode one. It is short. Let's go. would uh, react you know what I'm saying <laughs> he would be so excited <laughs> to actually talk to the Emperor for the first time someone keeps making that joke in my comment section man chill the toaster jokes bro you know who you are you've done it like twice or three times now man stop with toasters man Jesus but yeah man uh, I don't know I don't I don't want to you know surmise what this this uh, Adeptus Mechanicus dude is going to do with those toasters. But, you know, hopefully it's nothing too bad. Well, my divine lord, we have managed to implement a text-to-speech device to your glorious golden throne. Please, lord, speak to us. <laughs> I've got fucking time. At last! Our glorious lord can command us once again! I have so many things to complain about. First of all, <laughs> why do I only have a fucking glass eye on one of my eyes? <laughs> it's not really necessary. And why? It's with these ultra smirks that I keep hearing about. Oof. Uh oh. Oof. Why is he cussing ultramarines for, bro? Poor guys. It's true, why does he have one glass eye? I, can he see anyway? His body is deteriorated, dude. Like, what? Well, that certainly fucking explains it. It seems like their baby blue heraldry have earned them a most righteous nickname. For that matter, I always thought they looked terrible. <laughs> Do they still have that fucking toilet seat as their insignia? I don't know what their insignia is. Yes, they do, my lord. They... I can't lie, I don't know what their insignia look... I can't say the word. I don't know what their thingy looks like, bro. I don't know what their logo is. But well, the blue is a bit ugly. I will agree that I wouldn't want to be dressed in blue armor because that blue armor isn't the best looking armor. Oh, well, all right then. I always thought he was the greatest of my 20 Primarch sons. No, you didn't. Well, what? That's excellent. My the greatest love. little derivative pile of blueberry pudding pop fuckery <laughs> that has ever glazed the surface of this shitty little galaxy. Uh, oh. Is he still alive? Barely. He was almost killed. He's currently in state back in the old Marine's home world of a crowd. Cut his life supports and tell that stupid fucking Smurf village to fuck right off. <laughs> the constant uninterrupted chatting is drilling into my skull as if they were the immensely sanctimonious love child of Tinnitus and the jackhammer. <laughs> the pain of a million ripped out nose hairs are but a tender massage compared to this inexpressible ultra torture. Um, well, I'll see. But at least we still have our mighty great knights. 
I never created anything called Grey Knights. <laughs> Lord, they are the greatest of purging demons in the Imperium. They're all psychers, and they come up with the most glorious ways of killing the enemies of man. Why at the few you you bring in the Dread Knights? Oh greetings, my glorious Emperor. It is an honor. Oh myself, what the fucking fuck is that stupid ass thing? <laughs> it is the mighty Dread Knight. That is the worst thing that I have ever fucking seen ever. If I still had eyes, I would require someone to deposit Prometheum infused floor cleaner into them. What oh. terrible, terrible person designed this? Ouch. Ouch. That's just rude, bro. No, they don't insult the Grey Knights, man. I mean, you haven't watched a video on them yet. I don't know. I know the basics about them, but still. You don't have to insult him like that, poor guy. He can't see anyway, so I don't know what he's looking at, but, you know. The army technology of this marvelous machine was discovered by the Grey Knights and is held secretly for all inferior Astartes chapters. We are the mark! The exterior design, <laughs> I believe, to be personally designed by the Grand Master of the Grey Knights himself, Caldor Dragon. He is the mightiest of the Grey Knights. He is currently stuck in the warp, killing demons daily, pillaging demonic villages, and vandalizing the Chaos Gods' property like some kind of glorious rascal. He has even written a name on a demon Trilock's heart. Mm. For the love of all stop signs in the galaxy, seize and fucking desist. <laughs> what in the fuck? That is actually very cute. Look at its little legs and oversized body. Adorable. <laughs> Come to Papa, you. What? Wait, no! Don't! Yes. This is funny, Tommy. Well, my lord. I don't know about you, but I feel this is the start of something absolutely glorious. Shut your face, you fucking banana. Yes, my lord. Don't call him a banana. Come on, bro. Don't call him a banana. The other guy's in yellow armor, bro. He's the banana. He looks like a taxi cab, bro. Don't call it. Don't call him a banana, poor guy. You know what's funny is, why is the Custodes guy so fucking small? <laughs> why is he so small, dude? Why is he so small? He's surely the same size as those dudes. Well, actually, the guy's in dreadnought armor, so maybe not. I'm not too sure what the yellow guys are, to be honest. But yeah, man, some of the jokes, I'm not gonna lie, I didn't, I didn't understand them. But, you know, that's part and parcel of this, man. Like, if we wait forever to do this series, man, we're gonna, we're gonna be sitting here and just, like, watching lore videos upon lore videos, upon lore videos, and, you know, never get anywhere. So, yeah, man, that is the first episode of If the Tempera... If the Tempera... If the Emperor had a text-to-speech device, man, I'm pretty sure there's a lot more of these, to be fair. Probably gonna have to add episode 2 to my my uh, watch later. Oh, episode 2 so damn short, bro. Anyway, man, that's episode 1. We'll do some... We'll, we'll continue this on in a few days, man. We've got some more lore videos to watch. Someone explain to me who the yellow... Uh, Space Marine is, please. But anyway, thank you all for watching this video, man. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.